What's going on guys, how's it going? This is Tyler and today we're going to be doing another Pixel Gun 3D gun review. Today is going to be the Special Categories Mystical or Emitter. Uh, so this gun is pretty much a flamethrower area damage type gun. Uh, so we're going to try it out and see how it is. First off, I want to touch on a few things. Uh, first thing, if this video gets over 20 likes, I will continue doing uh, these uh, little gun reviews for Pixel Gun, but also, uh, if the quality is bad in this video, uh, I apologize. I'm using, or I guess trying out, uh, the new Shao uh, screen recorder or whatever, so instead of recording this video on my capture card with my computer and everything, I am doing it straight through my iPad, so if the quality is bad, uh, pixelated a little bit, uh, I'm sorry about that. Uh, I'm just trying this out to see just how good it is and if I can actually use it on a daily basis. But anyway, guys, we're going to be doing the Mystical Ore Emitter, and the, I, I'm low level, first thing, so I can only get the first upgrade for this gun, so the lethality is lower. But the thing is, I'm going to be playing against uh, mostly people that don't have armor, so it kind of makes up for the lethality. But um, lethality is 7, the fire rate is 98, capacity is 60, and the mobility is 110. So uh, let's go with a rocket, let's see, a rocket launcher or something, like... Pretty much all of the specials get the same movement speed, except for the high voltage gets 120. Alright, so this is pretty much the same uh, movement speed as all the others. So we're going to jump into Christmas Town since it is still the holiday season. We're going to continue, or not Christmas Town, we're going to play on uh, Toy Factory, this one right here. Uh, and we're just going to be trying it out a little bit. So the Flaming Volcano is actually recommended for this map. Uh, so uh, this ore emitter thing is supposedly like a... Uh, like a flamethrower, so we're going to use it on this map and try it out. Wow, okay, so first off the bat, I have noticed you have to be literally inside of someone to hit them. Look at this, I'm like, okay, so already off the bat, I'm seeing that this gun pretty much isn't up to par to be in the special category. Uh, now, like, in the special category, you have your rocket launchers, you have your solar ray rifle, you have your uh, freeze ray rifle thing, or whatever it's called. And then you have this this emitter, this ore emitter thing that's supposedly like a flamethrower. First, this thing perform, right now I'm seeing, is performing so much like a backup. Like a backup weapon, like a pistol. Uh, this is pretty much how this gun is performing. Now, it was cheap. Uh, it was like 120 coins, I believe. Um for the first upgrade for a lower level. Uh, so that is pretty cheap, but the damage isn't doing an really enough uh, for it to be in the special. Like, I, if I had a choice between, like, a rocket launcher or this, uh, I would definitely go with a rocket launcher. I would not... It's pretty much, using this gun, it, it's feeling like it's just taking up a space in my special category. I don't know. I'm gonna continue trying it out, seeing if I can kill people. But this guy just has regular wooden armor. And it just took me so long to kill him. If he actually had just a little bit of accuracy, he would have killed me. Period. Uh, so, I don't know. I don't know. It's just straight off the bat. I'm not getting a really good vibe from this gun. Uh, it's, like, it maybe, it would be good if it was in the, like, in the pistols or whatever, or in the backup section. Uh, but for a special, dude, like, this is really not performing the way that a special should. Uh, so, I think the only thing they... They didn't really go wrong with adding this gun into the game, uh, but they did go wrong with putting it in the special category. Uh, that's pretty much where this this gun completely, like, 100% goes wrong. Um, it looks cool, that's for sure. It's a cool idea, um, but, like, it just doesn't deserve the special category. It doesn't deserve that at all. Uh, maybe if it had a little bit more range on it, it might would, but n since you have to be... Pretty much, look how close I have to be. I have to be so close to somebody. I'm not even gonna play another game, cause that that let me know how how it actually performs. Um, like I said, it was pretty cheap. It wasn't expensive. It wasn't like you know 120 gems or anything like that. It wasn't crazy. Uh, but you know I won't be using it. Like I would rather look at this. I would rather go with the freeze ray rifle. The freeze ray rifle is really good, and it's only 120 gems. Like. Yeah, I say it's only 120 gems, but like, I don't know if it's like a three time, like if it's a three time sale like this. Uh, we'll go into the store right now and show you guys. Whenever it's a three time sale, you can get like a $15 iTunes gift card and get 300 gems. 
Uh, and yeah, you're spending money on the game. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people absolutely hate that. As do I. I hate, you know, pay to win or pay to buy, just buy weapons in general when you could just play and get coins or whatever. Um, but if it is a three times sale and you are desperate for guns and the ones that you have aren't doing it for you, you can get a fifteen dollar iTunes gift card, get three hundred gems if it's on a if it's a sale, a three times sale that they've been doing, uh, and you can get you know the freeze ray rifle uh, and the solar ray rifle or whatever um, for you know like ten dollars or whatever. So spending your your coins. Uh, yeah, see, it's 65 coins to, to upgrade it at level 17, and it gets, like, 12 more, or it goes up to uh, 13 uh, lethality. But overall, I just, it doesn't, it doesn't deserve the special category. It much, much better, it would be much better if it was in the backup section, for sure. Um, so, I don't know, it, the gun's not really a bust, but it... It is in a way that since it's in the special category, that is my only complaint about it is the range on it and the special category. That's it. Uh, but if you guys want to try it out and let me know what you guys think, this is just my honest opinion. Uh, that was my first game playing with it, and I don't know. I didn't get a good vibe from it. Um, but let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys have tried it out and if you like it a little more than I do. Uh, let me know that in the comments down below. Uh, but overall, guys, I would not... If you're needing a special weapon, I wouldn't put your coins into this one. I would go on to uh, something bigger and better. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I hope this helped you out a little bit. If you didn't know, if you wanted to see how it performed, if you wanted to see how it looked, there you go. Um, that's how it performs. That's how it looks. In the in the comments down below, tell me what you guys think about this gun. Do you like the look of it? Are you going to try it out? Uh, does this Did this video help you like change your mind about getting it or whatever? I don't know what you guys honest opinions of it but i don't i don't like this gun <laughs> anyway guys uh i hope you did enjoy if you did drop a like if we get over 20 likes i will continue doing these gun reviews and uh yeah let me know if you guys want to see any gameplays in the comments down below like i said this anyway guys this is tyler for like the 15th time trying to do the outro <laughs> i'll see you guys later peace